We're going to give a demonstration of how to install a holder golf grip. A couple things that you're going to need. You're going to need something to clamp the putter into a vise. I've got a speed clamp here which is uh, pretty nice to have but if you don't have one of those you can get one of these real cheap online any place that sells putter components and you use your vise from home. Clamp the uh, putter into your vise with the head as vertical as you can for alignment purposes and you'll see why here in a little bit. You'll need some grip tape. I've got just standard grip tape that I bought at uh, online uh, at, a, uh, at a golf club component store. To install the grip tape you just put it on here as straight as you can with a little bit of half inch overlapping the, the end. This piece of grip tape is the same length as, as the putter grip. Overlap it just a little bit. Wrap the club with that. Now if you're if the butt of your putter shaft is smaller than the uh, standard 580, you are gonna might need to put a couple pieces of grip tape on to build it up to fit the holder golf putter grip. That's double-sided putter uh, or grip tape. You take the uh, paper off, stuff the excess into the butt of the club, okay? Next thing you're gonna need is a little bit of uh, this is uh, mineral spirits. I use mineral spirits. Some people like to use soapy water. I use mineral spirits because I, I think it uh, works a little bit better for me. What you're going to want to do is wet slightly with the mineral spirits. A little bit on there. And a little bit inside the grip. Shake it around in there. I use a little bit more than normal just because we're going to need to adjust the putter grip once it's on there. You need to have it as slippery as possible. Pour a little bit more on there. All you do is slide the putter grip on there. Now this is where the important part is with the holder golf putter grip. You're going to want to line this up nice and uh, parallel to the head of the shaft. You want to get down here, look on it, and you'll be able to make adjustments as you go. But make sure that the flat parts of each side of the putter grip are aligned parallel to the face of the club. That's very important. That's why you get a little bit wetter than normal so that you can twist it if you need to. Get down, make sure the alignment is good. I even take it out of the, put it on the ground and line it up by eye using the ground. And if you need to adjust it a little bit more, it should be wet enough in there to bring it up and adjust it. From there, you wipe off all the excess and you got yourself a brand new club with a holder golf putter grip. I hope that helps. Reset your approach to putting. Find out how at holdergolf.com.